many Hunter students have already noticed a change in security since the shooting in Parkland, Florida. Today out of the, was the first day out of me being in school here for three years that I had a security guard look at my ID card and see that that person was me. And that was very shocking, you know, especially with what's going on. I'm actually pretty happy they did that. I think maybe out of all the days I've been in this school, I guess today I feel the safest. Junior Kaylin Vasquez thinks students need to take their security concerns nationwide and demand change. People like us who are being put in graves, so we need to be the ones who step up and do something as schools are doing throughout the country. There's been a lot of walkouts, a lot of protests. I think we need to continue doing that because we're the next generation of voters and um, we really need to let them know it's our lives on the line. Hunter's administration is well aware of the risks of an active shooter on a crowded campus and are paying more attention to the way students are acting, doing the most to avoid a preventable situation at Hunter College. Faculty are paying more attention uh, to listen to students, what they're saying, uh, what they're writing, uh, what they're asking, um, the, the, uh, the material, uh, the discussion in class and so forth, and they are alerting us, my office especially, is saying that I heard this, it may be nothing, but I want you to know about it. So we're looking for repeated patterns and so forth. Our Aveyans says an active shooter procedure will be shared with the Hunter College Senate on March 28th.